I'm John Tipling from Carillion Communications. Uh, we're an audiovisual system integrator and an authorised device reseller for the Microsoft Surface Hub device, which I have behind me here. So, there's a host of applications that are available um, for the Microsoft Surface Hub. All the applications that are important to your business can quite happily sit on here. Um, for example, if we take a look at jt to go developed by Siemens, is a 3D CAD viewer. So I can create something in an AutoCAD package, save it in a specific file type, and that then gives me a 3D model that I can bring into here and manipulate in real time. Now again, we can clip that and drop that into our whiteboard here because I may want to call out specific things as an example. This particular piece of software I can also annotate, I'll just give myself a little bit more room, I can also annotate directly into the software itself. As you can see there, and that will recall the various pieces that I've looked at. So really useful if we're into engineering or design, and we can still share this with people via Skype for Business using the present screen function. Another application example is Microsoft's Power BI, which gives us some business analytics and presents these in a dashboard form. Now, if I make that full screen, You can see that we've got some real useful information if I want to look at how the business is performing at any particular given time. And all of these I can click onto and we can drill down on them. Like so. And again, if any of these are relevant to the meeting that we're having, I can take them, drop them into my whiteboard for example, unplanned downtime might be the key metric that I'm trying to reduce that we can talk about. So once I get to the end of the session and I've, I've sent the notes out to everybody, I have a little I finish button down here. That's going to give me a 10 second countdown just to make sure that I've saved all of my data and forwarded that out to the delegates that are with me in the meeting. I can't save anything to the device itself, so I click I've finished. It gives me my 10 second countdown, I end the session. Now in not being able to save to the device, that means that if that was sensitive data, the next guys that come along can't get access to that, um, which is a good thing. It also means that every time I step up to one of these to use it, I get it in exactly the same state as it was the very first time that I used it. And the next guys can come along and they can pick up the pen and that drops us straight back into the whiteboard and again off I go with the next session. It's a great solution. It really does allow you to start meetings quicker, get more done, ultimately make quicker decisions and be more effective as a business.